Now, this is a question regarding a species known as helmeted hornbill. So, why this is a question means it was uh, declared as a critically endangered category by IUCN last year. So, that is why this was in news. So, uh, helmeted hornbill is also one of the most trafficked species in the world. So, that is why we need to know about helmeted hornbill. So, here the question is like this with reference to the helmeted hornbill which was in news recently consider the following statements. So, it was in news because IUCN categorized it as, it as a critically endangered category. Now, the statement is like this first statement the demand for hornbill ivory has pushed this avian species to the brink of extinction and second st statement the species is listed as a critically endangered animal by the international union for conservation of natures red list. So, these are the two statements they have given ok. So, now let us discuss about helmeted hornbill. So, this is a species known as helmeted hornbill. So, why it is called as helmeted hornbill means on the above the skull of that species along with that beak you can see a structure there and that is known as cask and that is made up of keratin. So, a keratin structure is there on the skull of that species this bird. So, that is known as cask ok. So, in order to get this cask this species was species is hunting. So, you can see the cask here. So, this is the cask, cask and this is the some ornaments made from that cask. So, in order to get this cask this species is mainly hunted for ok. So, so this helmeted hornbill it is a species mainly found in Thailand, uh, Indonesia, Malaysia like that region. So, helmeted hornbill is not found in India ok. It is not, not naturally found in India as per the IUCN records, but it is seen in the Thailand, Ma Malaysia like that states. Right. So, India is having hornbills like Indian great hornbill is there ok. So, regarding this helmeted hornbill, the helmeted hornbill is being hunted to extension and one of the latest victims of the thriving global trade in exotic wildlife. So, it is, it is one of the most trafficked animal or a species. So, by the close of 2015 the species had progressed from vulnerable to critically endangered category ok. So, earlier it was vulnerable category now it is declared as critically endangered category by IUCN. We know about IUCN's red list right, IUCN is categorizing the red list of animals based on the their threat right. So, these huge birds have been caught for centuries for their tail feathers ok, they are having uh, magnificent feathers also, for that also they have been hunted and this was also prized by local communities ok. The helmet and hornbill is threatened by poaching and wildlife trafficking which have risen significantly owing to increased demand for increased demand from China ok for helmeted hornbill ivory. So, uh, earlier I show you the picture of that species right and I show you the cask also. So, uh, that cask is known as helmeted hornbill ivory. So, it is also known as red ivory right. So, this cask is also known as red ivory that also you have to keep in mind. So, this species is mainly hunted for the hornbill's unique solid bill cask ok. So, that bill cask means that is a structure seen on the above the skull of that species. So, this statement is also important. Poachers are not interested in their brindle plumage or large bills, but a helmet like block of reddish gold keratin at the front of the skulls and it is known as cask. So, in order to get this cask this species is hunted for ok. So, these are the main points regarding helmeted hornbill and it is one of the most trafficked species in the world ok. Now, this is a species and this is the cask or called as red ivory and that is mainly used to make ornaments some jewels ok. In order to make some ornaments this cask is used for. So, this is a some ornaments made from that cask. Now, coming to question again with reference to the helmeted hornbill which was in news recently consider the following statements and first statement is the demand for hornbill ivory has pushed this avian species to the brink of extinction ok. So, we discussed about hornbill ivory and that means cask red ivory. So, red ivory, hornbill ivory or cask all these are same that means that uh, keratin structure on the front of or above the skull of that species is known as this red ivory or hornbill ivory. In order to get that hornbill ivory in order to make uh, jewels or ornaments this species is hunted. So, the first statement is correct. Now, regarding the second statement the species is listed as a critically endangered animal by international Union for conservation natures red list. So, that also correct because it was uh, declared as a IUCN category critical endangered category ok from vulnerable earlier it was vulnerable category now it is declared as a critical endangered category by IUCN ok in their red list data book right that also we discussed. 
because it was hunted for extinction that is why it is declared as critical energy category. Now regarding this statement so far UPSC does not ask any question regarding critical endangered category ok. So till now UPSC asked about endangered category so they will be giving some animals and we have to identify which of the given species are endangered category like that question over there. Since it is a one of the most trafficked animal we can expect a question on critical endangered category of that species right. So here both the statements are correct so here the answer is C both 1 and 2 are correct.